Class dismissed. Just because you have to stay off the school, you'd better let go of me. What if I don't, huh? What if I don't? You'll see, you big bully. Me, why I wouldn't hurt a fly? Maybe not, but you're going to love eating them, you... you big bully frog. <laughs> And don't forget that... Tabitha, you're the first frog freak I've ever met. So I'm not just sure how to deal with you. But let's begin by putting the frog back in the terrarium. But this frog isn't the frog you think it is. Tabitha, the terrarium. me, Tabitha. Put that frog back where it belongs. But honest, this frog isn't really a frog. The frog isn't really a frog. I mean, he's a frog, but he really isn't. Oh, stop this nonsense and put that frog back. Yes, ma'am. Tabitha, I realize this hasn't been a very good first day for you, but I'm perfectly aware that it isn't entirely your fault. Tabitha, will you look at me when I'm speaking to you? I'm sorry. You're the product of an overprotective mother. And I just wish... Never mind. <laughs> My mommy's going to wonder where I am. I'd better run. Goodbye. <laughs> say I admire your cool. It's only a five-minute walk from our house to school, which let out 15 minutes ago. Darren, you're being overly concerned. As a matter of fact, here comes Tabitha now. How do you know? How does she know? Oh, boy. I'm really wigging out. Hi, Mommy. Hi, Daddy. Oh, hi, honey. How was school? Oh, it's still there. You see? I told you there was nothing to be worried about. <clears throat> well, I'd better uh, get back to work. Mommy, can I go play outside? Oh, sure. You want a snack, some milk and cookies? Yes, thank you. In a minute. <laughs> Charlton, you're just being stubborn. I'm trying to change you back. Tabitha, where did you get that frog? Mommy, you'll never guess what happened. Is that frog who I think he is? You're smart, Mommy. You only needed one guess. It's Charlton. I thought you said you were going to try and control yourself. I tried and tried, honest. But Charlton grabbed me after class, and he kept twisting my arm and hurting me. So what could I do? You could have punched him in the nose or kicked him in the shins. Anything would have been more ladylike. The trouble is, I can't change him back. What are we going to do? Well, uh, the first thing we're going to do is not panic. The second thing we're going to do is call Charlton's mother. She's probably worried sick. Come on. Mm -hmm. 